Ruto resign, dissolve your entire government starting from you, Rigade Mudavadi, the unappointed chief of staff, your advisors, all the bureaucrats, CEOs, everyone, the IGO police, the DCI, all the killer squads. It's too late now. You can't get out of this through PR stunts. No games, no tricks, no canoe abracadabra. Ruto, you must resign and go now. You are weak, you are cornered, your lies have been exposed. Kenyans have rejected you. We have recalled you under Article 1 of the Constitution. The power vested on the sovereign people of Kenya to exercise power directly. And the Gen Zs and the millennials and the revolutionary patriots have said enough is enough. You have killed too many people. You have not apologized for any of the deaths. You've not done anything to show that you are contrite. There is going to be no difference between the so-called cabinet you are going to appoint and the ones that you have just uh, quote unquote suspended. You've not dissolved anything. We are going back to the polls. The IBC cannot be set up in your own image so that you can rig the next elections. We are going to reconstitute the IBC afresh, an accountable, transparent IBC that only answers to the people of Kenya. You are irredeemably corrupt. You are irredeemably a, a tyrant. You cannot be saved. You are beyond redemption and you must resign now. This is the irreducible minimum. Ruto must go. Viva. Ah, thank you very much, Mr. William Ruto. It is still not done. We are not yet done with you. We want to clean the system. We want a clean slate. This is just a lip service you've done to us. You knew they were corrupt. You knew your ministers were incompetent. You knew they were corrupt. You knew they do not know any direction. They lost the, the, the Cardinal North. It is not done until you suck IG Kome. It is not done until you suck Mr. Bungei. It is not done until you have the killer cops charged in the court of law. And on Tuesday, the 16th of July, we are coming to the streets to remind you that this is, a, this is Kenya. Kenya belongs to us all. We are not tenants in this country. We shall be there to remind you that you must be accountable to the people. We shall be there to tell you that Kenya must and must and must be governed by the rule of law. In so far as Mr. Bungay is in office, and in so far as Mr. Bungay is in office, and Kome is in office, and Ms. Amin, Mr. Amin, the DCI is in office, we are not yet done. To Jamalizana na we we are still coming for you, whether you abduct us or you don't abduct us, whether you kill us or you don't kill us, there shall be people who shall perpetuate and propagate the revolution ahead. The struggle will continue. Viva! Viva! I have never, never supported Ruto for the last two years, but today I support what he has done. He has dissolved the cabinet, except the office of the deputy president, and that of Prime Minister Msari Amudabadi. Kila mtu wapeleko nyumbani, including the Anthony General. Kila mtu wapeleko nyumbani. All those yeses, wenye nimekua ni kilalamika up all the time, watu wameenda nyumbani. President William Samoy Ruto, do the right thing now. Go and look for competent Kenyans, because we have them. Because we all have Kenya. Just do the right thing for once. You can do this. Look for the competent Kenyans and make them the cabinet secretaries. You will see things will change. Correct. Kenyans, you have won. You have won this one. Not just for yourself, but for the rest of us Africans. You have taught us a really great lesson, which is the power is with the people. 
And when the people rise up and say no to nonsense, everything will change. And that's exactly what you did. I just saw the press conference the President William Ruto held. He literally fired all cabinet secretaries and attorney general because the people said no. This is a lesson to all of us. Well done, Kenyans. We're proud of you. Thank you, Mr. President, for taking action to, to such a psychopath called Murkomen. Murkomen alikuwa ametutesa sana, sana. Anaongea na brightness. Hadi anaenda kwa TV anasema saa yangu nilileta from outside the country, belt. Nini? Yaani alisema hadi boxer bwana. This is unfortunately a, a serious a minister of this country talking such nonsense in a media. Murkomen anasema Rudy Field ya law. Enda unda law farm yako ka uko baada tukutaki hata MCA uko ilgo mara kwa tutapata.